friends and how are you today fine. fine are you fine as frogs hair are you feeling well you're not feeling sick or anything are you I'm glad to hear it you look happy everybody looks happy are you happy at your house well I'm happy today because we're going to have a very exciting day today in romper room do you know that I have a friend from the Ringling Brothers Barnum and Bailey circus to come and talk to us today anybody know what kind of friend that might be what a clown, yes, we have a clown who's going to do some magic with us and play a game with us today. And we're going to play quick draw today. So maybe you'll want to have a piece of paper and a crayon at your house. And we're going to play volleyball and catch the dragon's tail. And we're going to throw the bean bags and we're going to sort and we're going to sing a song and we're going to we're just going to have a lot of fun. Sounds like a good idea to me. What do you think, Jill? Should we have fun today? It's a lot more that's better than not having fun, isn't it? Do you know how to play Jack in the Box, everybody? Yeah. yeah. What happens when I say Jack in the Box? Go where down. do you go? Down in all the, the way, Jimmy, and in the box. And where do you go when I say Jack in the Box? Oh, in. you were good. You were listening. How about when I say Jack out of the box? <laughs> Jack out of the box. Jack out of the box. Out of the box. Out of the box. You were listening. You were listening. Did you listen at your house? Jack, out of the box. Out of the box, Simeon. Out of the box. Jack. Out of the box. Jack in the box. Jack in the box. Jack out of the box. Jack in the box. Jack in the box. Jack in the box. Jack in the box. Jack out of the box. Jack out of the box. Jack in the box. Jack out of the box. Jack in the box. Jack out of the box. Jack in the box. Jack out of the box. Jack in the box. Jack in the box. Jack in the box. Jack in the box. That's it. Jack in the box. Jack in the box. Jack in the box. You're lit. You're really good listeners. I can't fool you at all. Jack out of the box. Jack out of the box. <laughs> I, I listened. Why did you listen? Because you said out in the box. But I went in the box. So what should you do? Go out of the box. Stay out of the box. Stay out of the box. Pull your skirt down, kiddo. Jack out of the box. Simeon and Jack. Jack out of the box. Up here. Jack out of the box, that's it. Jack out of the box. Jack in the box. Jack in the box. In the box, Jerry. That's it. In the box. Jerry, in the box. Okay, Jack out of the box then. If you want to be out of the box, we'll be out of the box. Jared, didn't I promise you you could hold the flag? Why don't you go get it? Well, you can hold another time, okay? Stand right there, Jarrett. Stand nice and still. Well, why don't you tell me which is your right hand? Give it a try. Very good. That's your right hand. You have your right hand? Yes, you have your right hand over your heart. Put your left hand down at your side. This one? No, the other one, Simeon. That's it. This one is your right hand. That's it. Put your other hand down at your side. Nope, Jill, other hand. That's it. Friends at home, this is your right hand. Okay, hold the flag nice and still, Jarrett, for me. Turn around, Simeon. No, 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 this hand. That's it. That's it. Don't be silly when you're saying the Pledge of Allegiance. You have to be serious. You ready? Put your hand, put your hand down, Aaron. Oh. Very serious about this, okay? You have to stand still for the Pledge of Allegiance. All right, you ready? I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible with liberty and justice for all. Jarrett, let me have the flag, please. Let me hold it. 
Bring it here. I'll tell you why. Come here. Bring it here. Because look over there. You know who's here? Granny and Up Up. See, there she comes. See, Granny? I wonder what Granny and Up Up are going to talk about today. I bet Up Up has a problem. <laughs> Take that. <laughs> oh, Granny, I have a trick to end all tricks. <laughs> Wait until Doobie comes around that corner. <laughs> oh, gee. <laughs> I've been meaning to talk to you, Up Up, about your joke. Uh, later. See, I got this trick squirting flower. And as soon as Doobie comes around, I'm going to pop out and squirt him. <laughs> Oh, gee. <laughs> oh, no, you can't. Oh, yes, I can. I've got great aim. <laughs> that big bee won't know what hit him. <laughs> oh, up, up, behave yourself. Doobie will be a wet bee before long. <laughs> <laughs> Jokes are fine if they make people laugh. But you have to realize that jokes should not be done to hurt people's feelings. Oh, Doobie might not get much of a laugh out of this, but I will. <laughs> oh, I better practice. Ready, aim, up, up. What? I took the water out of your flower. You did? Mm -hmm. Oh, Granny. Why did you do that? Well, you're no fun. To me, fun is playing with friends. Reading, singing, not squirting and playing tricks. Gee, you are weird. I like to laugh with people, not at them. Oh, my jokes don't cause any harm. Oh, well... Now that my flower's empty, everything's ruined anyway. I... Oh! What's uh, the matter, Up Up? You said that you emptied this. What? It was full of water. I could have gotten wet. <laughs> so, I was teasing. Can't you take a joke? Oh! oh. oh. <laughs> Hello, everybody. This is Digger. A trip to the playground can really be fun, but we got to be careful as we jump and we run. See saw, teeter, totter, up and down, but we don't get off till our feet touch the ground. When we run across the street, we stop and look both ways. Make sure no cars are coming. We'll take our time, okay? Always play safe till the fun is all through. Take care of your friends. And be careful with you! I wish I could play like the other kids, but I have asthma. I'm afraid if I play, I'll get breathless. It's a bird! It's a plane! It's Superman! Kids with asthma don't have to sit out the good times. Now there's a fun self-help kit from the American Lung Association called Super Stuff. Every Super Stuff kit full of games and puzzles comes with information that helps kids and parents learn about asthma. Follow your doctor's orders and get some coaching from Super Stuff. Contact your American Lung Association. We now return to Lambert and Friends. Look who's here. I keep my promises. This is Ruth. And Ruth is from Ringling Brothers Barnum and Bailey Circus. Welcome to Romper Room. Thanks. I'm glad to be here. Nice to meet you. Thanks. She's a pretty clown, isn't she? I love her. I love, your, I love your orange hair. Little Very Hannah. attractive. Yes. Little yes. Hannah. And the green hat is left over from St. Patrick's Day last weekend, right? Very good. Now, Ruth is here to tell us that the circus is coming to town. Actually, it's going to be in New York. The circus That's is going to be right. in Madison Square Garden from April 3rd to June 3rd. And not only is Ruth in the circus, but you teach at the at Clown, the clown college. college. Right. I thought you were auditioning a few yes, moments Yes, yes, I want to go to the Clown saw College. <laughs> How frustrating clown. Do you think Miss Molly could go be a clown? Yeah. Sure. Sure, yeah. sure. What do you teach at the Clown College? Well, I teach makeup and I te teach clowning. And along with all those things, there's also teachers that teach juggling, unicycling, acrobatics, stilt walking. Improvisation, you name it. Gee, it's there's, a lot, there's a lot that goes into being a clown. Did you yeah. think that, that, that being a clown was easy? That you could just go and 
be a clown? Yeah. Sure. Ah. <laughs> Not so easy. Not so easy. Well, you also do magic, don't yeah, you? Yeah, I thought we'd do some magic. I heard okay. everybody were, was magicians around here. Is that sure. right? Sure. We so you're going to come You're gonna come help me? Come Jill. Help here. Jill. Jill, why don't you and go? Simeon. Simeon. Okay? And you stand right over here. Simeon. You stand on this side. Okay? And Jill, you stand right here. And what we're going to do is we're going to look at a special bag that the clowns sent us, okay? So, oh, let's see what we have inside here. Oh, oh my goodness. You know what that is? What huh? is that? It's a, it's a magic stick. wand. It's a, it's a magic, magic stick. stick. That's right. So what I want you to do, can you hold on to this for me? Now, I'm going <gasps> to reach right... Oh, oh what let's see what happened? Now, let's see. Just a, oh, There we go. All right, tell you what, Jill, you hold on to this, okay? Now, what I'm going to do... Oh. <laughs> now, Jill, let's try one more time. Let's see what's wrong here. There we go. Okay, hold on tight. It's not going to fall, is it? You got it? Oh, oh, oh. oh. <laughs> I think my magic wand forgot his vitamin. Uh-oh, Sabrina says she can do it. Are you going to try it? Okay, oh, let's try. I don't try. know. There we go. Okay, Sabrina, there you No, that's the uh, depth. Uh, oh. <gasps> Maybe Sabrina okay. can do it. Let's see. Let's <laughs> see. Let's see. There we go. Okay, you got it? <laughs> 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 oh. All right, well, we might as well let Aaron One try more it, too. Time. There you go. Uh, <laughs> no, no. So we we'll let it go to sleep. No. <laughs> Doesn't work. And what we'll do is we'll take a look at this magic bag the clown's in, okay? Now, is, was there anything in there? No. Let's check again. Let's make sure. Anything in there? No. No. Okay. Tell you what I want you to do. I'm going to count to three and I want you to say circus. All right? Ready? One, two, three. Circus. All right. Oh, my goodness. Let's see. Can you hold that? Oh, there we go. And we've got the colors from the circus. Wow. We better send them back, don't you think? What color is this? Yellow. Yellow, that's right. And what color is this? Green. 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 There we go. And what color is this? Orange. Orange. There you go. And the fastest way to send something is airmail, right? <laughs> so everybody blow right on this bag, okay? You ready? One, two, three. <gasps> there we go. <gasps> All right. Send it Thank back. you very much. Thank you. All oh. right. There we go. Does that mean that Simeon Red. and Jill were magic? And They're all the friends at home when they blew, they were magic, too? That's right. Sarah, Everybody. Sarah, you decided to magician. join us. All right. Sit down, all buddy. That's right. terrific. There we go. You know, I have something else here. We have acrobats with the show. Anybody know what an acrobat is? Do you know? What's an acrobat, Deb? A ballerina. Well, sometimes they, acrobats they're look very like good. ballerinas. They're very good... Who else? What else? What else, Sabrina? Go ahead, tell us. Apples. <laughs> well, I have some acrobatic like. blocks with me. Acrobats are the are the men and women that go on the trapeze, or they walk on the there high wire, go. or they do flips. And we have a man that does a quadruple this year. Only time it's ever been done. And these acrobats travel about 70 miles an hour. And my acrobatic blocks travel that fast too so i'm going to show you how they work do you right know now. what a quadruple means that means he's going to flip four times four quad means four all right now what i have here are my magic abc blocks that are acrobats and do you know what shape that is yeah. rectangle that's right it's a rectangle and what shape is this Red. Is anything inside there? No. No. Can you hold that for me? There you go. Make sure nothing's inside there. All right. And do you know what this is? A bag. It's a paper bag. Is anything inside there? No. No, nothing at all. Let's see. Where can we put this? We'll just put this right back over here. All right. Now, can you see? What's the first block I have? A. And what color is the A block? Blue. Blue, that's right. We're going to take the A block and we're going to put it right inside that bag. Now, what's the second block? 
And what color's the beak? Red. Red, that's right. And we're going to put it right inside there, too. Now, what's this last block? And what color? Very good. All right. Now, how many blocks are on this stick? Nine. How many over in there in that box? Nine. Nothing Nine. in there? Okay, and how many are in the sack? Three. Very good. Boy, you guys are smart. And what we're going to do is we're going to bring the C back and put it there. And then we're going to bring the B back and put it right on top there. And the last block is what? The A block. And we're going to put it right there. Now, can I have the right? Thank you very much. And now we're going to put this right over the A, the B, and the C. Everybody say circus. Circus. Yeah. All right. And that's... <gasps> B, I do you have the B? Do you have the B? Do, Do I have friends the, at home have the bed? <gasps> oh my goodness. <gasps> wow. Look how B fast those. <laughs> they travel fast, don't they? Gee, they wow. sure do. Wow, that's right. That was great. Right. Are they in there? They're in there again. They're sure. in there again. They're in there. That's right. And that's how fast. Those acrobats in the circus travel sometimes so fast that you can't even see them. Gee. Now, do you mm -hmm. have anyone that walks on the high wire? We sh sure do. Do you think that we, we could pretend lot. that we... I bet y'all could be high wire walkers. What okay. do you think? No. Well, we could pretend <laughs> on our balance beam, couldn't we? Would you like do to you try have a it? balance beam? Sure, we have a balance All beam right, right over here. Let's Look. go. Can you at your Let's house pretend see. that you have a balance beam and see if you can pretend that you're on the high wire? Go wow. ahead. There you go, Deb. Oh, why don't you turn around so the friends at home can see you? Yeah, let everybody see. Sure. Do you know what song this is that's playing? Oh, this nice. is our circus song. It's called Circus I heard Surprise. about this mm -hmm. song. Just for you. All right, yeah, Deb. Wow. I think Deb could be called an acrobat. Oh, you? boy, Whoa. yes. Oh. Whoa. Whoops, be careful. Watch where you're going. Turn around and look. Why don't you turn around and go forwards, Deb, since the balance Ooh. beam turns. Here, turn around for me, okay? Please. That's there it. Very go. good. See, All because right. it bends, I don't want you to fall off. There you At your go. house, pretend there that you have one go. foot in front of the other, sure. and you're balancing and on you the balance, balance with your Go arm. ahead, Sabrina. And now, in the center ring, on All the right. home corner, we have Woo. Sabrina. Woo. You hear the crowd cheering, Sabrina. All right. That's it. And next to attempt the high wire feet is Jared. Now, you know what oh, else I'd right. like to... You didn't fall, good for you. That's you know what I'd right. like to explain to everybody, Ruth, and explain to the friends at home as well? The people in the circus who work on the high wire right. or the trapeze, they are called professionals. You know what that's, it means by professional? right. They are trained to do that. Now, we can pretend that we're on the high wire on our low balance beam, that's but at your right. house, don't ever try and don't go anything go high. high. No, you can uh -uh. try on something low. Because That's all right. of the men and women in the circus practice a very long time That's to be able to right. do what they do. What do you think? Simeon, can you get across that balance beam? You went all the way across there, and didn't you? Good for you. I'm gonna do That's right. You know what? Why don't we give Ruth a turn? Ruth hasn't had a turn, neither has Jill. Go ahead, Jill. Go ahead, yeah. Go ahead, Ruth. Go. Why don't you go after oh. Jill? You think you could you think well, you can hey. oh, now this is my no, kind of wire. Do you think those big shoes can make it all the way across? No. Oh. 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 No face. No face. Yeah. <laughs> Come here, Ray. Thank you to you. Everybody want to say thank you to Ruth? All right. There we she, you go. You were super. Right. You were super. Well, it was great well, meeting you guys. It was very nice meeting you, and I'd like to thank my friend, friends at Ringling Brothers for letting you come to see yeah. us. Yeah, Super. we'll see y'all all and at the circus. That's right. That's April right. 3rd to June 3rd at Madison Square Garden That's in New right. York. Well, don't go away at your house now, because when we come back to Romper Room, we're going to have a lot more fun again. Romper Room friends will return after these messages.
Once there was an old Spaniard, Don Quixote, who jousted windmills with a giant toothbrush, shouting, Teeth are meant to last a lifetime. Everyone thought he was weird. <laughs> then one day his trusted friend Sancho explained the true meaning of Don Quixote's battles. He wants to show how you can defeat the foes of dental health with good eating habits and brushing and flossing every day. After that, the villagers understood why Don Quixote battled windmills with a toothbrush. But they still thought he was weird. Oh, uh, am I weird? A message from the American Dental Association. I'm Woodsy Owl, and I'm here to tell you about a dirty word, pollution. Help Woodsy spread the word. Never be a dirty bird. Hoo hoo! Don't paint a right on buildings. That's pollution. Give a hoo! Don't pollute. Never, Never be a dirty bird. bird. Hoo hoo! Turn your radio down. That's noise pollution. In the city or in the woods, help keep America looking good. We now return to our friends. Friends, I just had an idea. How would you like to draw a picture of Ruth, the clown, or any kind of clown, it doesn't even have to be Ruth, and send it here to Romper Room and Friends, Post Office Box 9, Secaucus, New Jersey, 07094. And if you don't feel like drawing a picture of a clown, that's okay. You could draw a picture of one of our Romper Room characters, or the rainbow, or maybe you could draw a picture of yourself and send it to me. Wouldn't that be neat? That would be very nice. I'll make a picture of a person, and it's going to be green. It's going to be green? Well, that'd be it's fun. Be... I got bread for you. Oh, <gasps> you do? Oh, Simeon. <gasps> I have a present for you. I have a bouncing ball. Do you have a bouncing ball at your house? Maybe you could ask a grown-up what you could use yeah. to play milk carton bowling with us. Maybe you have a milk I'll carton have, at your I'll house. Have bouncing balls. You have bouncing balls at your house? Well, what you can do is ask a grown-up what you can set up to see if you can knock them over. Now, Sabrina, I'm going to give it to you. Now, wait till I get over there so that I can set them back up and see how many you can knock over. Give it a try. Oh, what you have to try to do, try and roll it on the ground. In fact, Aaron, move back and give Sabrina room, okay? Everybody move back so each of you get a turn to have room. Go ahead, Sabrina. Roll it on the ground. That's it. Oh, I think you were too far away. Let me move these forward a little bit. How's that? Try again, Sabrina. Oh, that's it. Oh, there goes the green one. There you go. Try one more time. See if you can push it a little. I know I did. I gave it a little because it already started to go down. That's it. Oh, these blocks are stubborn today, aren't they, Sabrina? They're stubborn. Well, let's see. You did well. You got them to wiggle. That was good. See if Aaron can try. See if Aaron can try. You go over behind Jarrett, Sabrina, and maybe you'll be able to get another turn. Aaron, try and go behind the line. Now wait, you know what? You all have to move back a little bit because you're not giving the person who has the ball a chance. Wait, wait, wait. I will tell you when, okay? Move back, please, for me, and give Aaron room. You'll get a turn. Come right here. Come on, I'll give you a turn, Simeon. Stand right here. No one is going to miss their turn, but you don't need to push in front either, okay? You stand right here. You were between Deb and Jarrett. Jarrett, move back a little bit. Simeon was right there, and Jarrett, you're right here. Everyone will get a turn. No one will miss. Just make sure that you give Aaron a little room. Now spread your legs apart for me, Aaron, please. That's it. Now take the ball down and push. That's it. See? There you go. You want to try it once by yourself? Make sure you ask a grown-up at your house what you can use. All right. Oh, good. You got two of them. Good for you. Good for you. Did you get it for me? Thank you, Jarrett. Whoops. Thanks. Okay, should we give Jill a turn now, Aaron? You got three of them down. Good for you. All right, Jill, what do you say? Give it a shot. Aaron, go ahead behind Sabrina, please. Look what you did to the yellow one. It went sideways. Well, let it go because maybe next time... We'll leave it there. Maybe next time she'll knock it over. Like that, see? See, those two went down. How about if I move those? You can try one more time. 
The blue one. Good for you. All right, let's give Deb a turn. Let's give Deb a turn. There you go. And Simeon's going to be after Deb, and then you'll go, Jared, okay? Thank you. Oh, Deb, that was good. The green one hit the red one. Move back a little and give Deb room, please. All right. You want to get that for me, somebody? Oh, we have another one anyway. Here. Thanks. There you go. That was good, Deb. You got two. All right, Simeon, what do you say? How many? Wow, you got the one in the middle and the one on the end. Sabrina, would you please move back because Jared hasn't had a turn yet. Thank you. There you go, Simeon. Oh, off to the side. What you need to do is have room. Everybody move over and give Simeon room, please. Look where you're throwing it. That's it. Good. You got three. Very good. Very good. All right, Jarrett. What do you say? That was good, Simeon. You're strong. Wait, you have to go behind the line, Jarrett. Oh, that was good. Move back a little bit for me, though. Yeah, look at the red one got stuck on those two. Oh, almost. Try one more time. Whoa, that time you got it. Good for you. Almost got the blue one. Almost got the blue one. Do you think I could get the blue one? Do you think I could get the blue one? Look, there we go. Now I think we better fix it. And while we fix it, don't you go away at your house. In fact, why don't you get a crayon and some paper you can play on because when we come back, we're going to play Quick Draw. Robbery and Friends will return after these messages. Hello, everybody. This is Digger. A trip to the playground can really be fun, but we gotta be careful as we jump and we run. Don't stand on the swing. Hold on with both hands, then stop completely. <laughs> That's the right way to land. Sliding down slides is a pretty neat treat. Wait till no one's in front, and then land on our feet. Always play safe till the fun is all through. Take care of your friends. And be careful with you. Charmkins, Charmkins, they love hanging around. The nicest thing about Charmkins is their jewelry. Little mom and school mornings, take them with you around town. Now you can take them with you in the Charmkins jewelry case. You've got brown eyed Susan, too. She's pretty. Charmkins, Charmkins, they love hanging mm. around. Charmkins smell so nice. Charmkins charms, accessories, and jewelry case. Sold separately from Hasbro. Delicious fruit flavored tricks, and I want some. This job calls for a super disguise. Yeah, what is it? Oh, it's fruit flavored tricks. Dropping in for some? I'm here to help kids of America eat tricks as part of this good, nutritious breakfast. Tricks taste real fruity. Tricks has fruit taste I like. There's lemon, there's orange in every bite. Whee! The rabbit. Ooh. Silly rabbit tricks are for kids. Even super rabbits get hung up on tricks. We now return to Robert Friends. Do you have a crayon and some paper you can play on? What time is it? What time? Quick draw. I can't hear you. Quick draw. It's quick draw time. Can you draw with me at your house? Draw as fast as you can. You ready? Now listen to the music, fast or slow, put the crayon on the paper, let's 
Did you draw at your house? Did you draw wiggly squiggly lines? Did you draw flowers? Did you draw hmm, houses or doobie? That's purple and green. That looks pretty nice to me, Jared. Thank you for giving me back the markers. Oh, and that's orange and blue. That's terrific, Sabrina. Could you put the cap back on your marker? Thank you, Jill. Thank you, Jill. And you, oh, look at you have doobie with hearts around it. That's very nice, Deb. Can I, can I do this purple? Well, you know what we're going to do? I'm going to take the markers from everyone because I would like to go over and sort some shapes. Would you like to do that with me? Can I have your markers, please, Deb? Put the covers on them. At your house, put your crayons away. Put the covers on them. There you go. Our friends in Romper Room will put this away for us. There you go. That's super. Let's go over here. To... You made Doobie too? That's super, Jared. Oh, that's really very pretty. That's very pretty. That looks like a person. You made that. I like that, Aaron. Come on over here with me for a second because with the quick draw, we had colors. And I have some more colors here. Can you all sit down for me? Sit down for me, please. I know all the colors. Sit down for me. I know all the colors. You do? Well, let's see what we can find. If you sit down for me, you can tell me what we have. Green. What is this? Brown. Brown. But what kind of a shape is that? I know the gun. What? I know the gun. Very good, Jill. Very good. What, Sabrina? Pentagon. Very good. You knew, too. This is a pentagon. Why is it called a pentagon? How many sides does it have? One, two, four. Five. Oh, let's count again. Five. One, five. two, five. three, four, five. 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 Very good. Very good. I sit want to down. Do the dog. I, you know what I'd like everybody to do? I'd like everybody to sit down and you can tell me as I point to them, okay? Is that, is that a good deal? You can move forward, Deb, so you can see too. Very good. What is that? Star. That's a purple star. You're right. Yellow. That's purple. Yellow. 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 Oh, you're right. It's yellow. This is a purple. Do me a favor. Please sit down so the this friends at home can this see, too. This is purple and this is blue. I know. I know. Can, can you be patient for just a little bit and tell me when I tell you, when I ask you? Uh-oh. There's a monster behind me. Simeon, what are you doing back there? What are you doing? Come on around so I can see you. Come here so I can see you. Oh, be careful. Come on, sit over here so I can see you and you can see what we're doing. What's the matter? My buddy. I thought you were trying to scare me. Come here, stand up. Tell me what's wrong. Stand up. Hmm? You want to sit there? I know Come here, buddy. Stand up. Oh, what's the matter? Hmm? Nothing? You want to point to it? You wanted to point to the star? Okay. Here, stand here. Stand here a second. How many sides does it have? Count with me. One, One two, two, three, three five, four, five. 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 Very good. Come on, Aaron. Well, we'll count how many sides are on this. What is this shape? That is a rectangle. All right, we have one, two, three, four on the rectangle. Now, are all those sides the same? No. No? Why? Are they all the same length? Wait a minute. 
Oh, you're right, Sabrina. You were pointing to let me know that this is also a rectangle. It's just smaller. Yes, Aaron. Oh, hi, Jarrett. Move around for me, please. Thank you. Thank you. These two are the same. Good for you. What is this? Square. Oh, what color is that square? Orange. Orange. What do you want, Simeon? One, hmm? two, oh, okay. I'll tell you when we four, get to that. Four, four sides. Four. Now, are, are all four, of these sides the same? No. And it's okay. on the point. All right. Okay. I'm, all right. I'm what is this? This is great. I'm going to do this. That's right. Friends at home can't see either. Sit down for me, please, okay? Yeah. Sit down. Okay, Simeon, what is that that you have your finger circle. on? Circle. What color is that circle? Purple. 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 What is that you have your hand on, Aaron? A diamond. A diamond. And what color is it? Green. 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 Good. Please don't, don't pull on each other. Don't pull. The You're right. You can't really count the sides on the circle, can you, Deb? Yeah, because it goes all the way around and it's continuous. No, because it's continuous. See, these sides stop, like on the diamond. It stops and goes to a point. There are points here, points here, squares here, corners. All of these have corners. A circle doesn't have a corner. That's why it's called a circle. That's why it's called a circle. What's your hand on? What is that? A blue rectangle. That's right. Well, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to find some bean bags. Do you think we could find some bean bags so that our friends... Look, wait. I have two bean bags here. And if we get in line over here... Come on over here. Move over this way a little bit. Well, what you're going to do... Oh! Well, hi there. Come on in. You can join us. I have lots. Well, you're all going to take your turns, and I'm going to tell you what we're going to do. We're going to play beanbag toss with the visitors. Come over here, please. Everybody get in line behind me, please. Can you get in line behind me and try not to push? Try not to push for me, please. Go ahead. Get into a line. Get into a line. You did. All right. Then what I'm going to do is I'm going to hold on to this basket, and at your house, why don't you see if you have a basket or bean bag? Ask a grown-up. Let's move the line over this way a little bit. Move down this way so you can all get a turn. And then move back this way. Wait. Oh, no. Now we're confused. Straight behind me. Straight behind me. Straight that way. Okay. Go ahead and get in line, hon. There you go. All right. Simeon, stand. You're first. Stand right here. Please don't push. Simeon, come on over here and stand. Stand here, Simeon, please. I'm going to come over here, and I'm going to hold on to the basket. And you see if you can throw the bean bag into the basket, Simeon. Give it a try. Very good. Very good. You want to try it, Jared? Into the basket. Move back a little bit for me, please. Move back a little bit so you have more room. That's it. Now, right into the basket. Oh, almost. It hit my hand. Oh, it was close. It was close. Go to the back of the line so other friends can have a turn, please. Give it a try, Aaron. Whoa! What you have to do is watch, look at the basket. Oh, almost, just a little bit further. That's it, oh, that was close, that was close. Go ahead to the back of the line so our other friends can have a turn. Whoa, first try, good for you. Good for you, why don't you let our other friend have a turn too? We'll all get one turn. Oh, it went in, but it bounced out. Go ahead to the back of the line. There you go. Well, hello, Simeon. Oh, almost. That was very close. That was very close. Let's let our other friend have a turn, okay? You'll all get a turn to play again soon. Oh, almost. Try it again and see if it was, see if you can aim at the, that's it. Good, very good. Chill. Oh, almost. That was close. That was close. Go ahead to the back so we can keep going. There you go. Oh, very good. That just kind of slid right in there. There you go. Very good. It hit the basket, but it bounced out. That was good. All right. Right in the basket. Good for you. Good for you. Simeon, how did you get in line again? Some of our other friends haven't had a turn. Would you go back until, until it's your turn to have a second turn? Because our other friends need to have a first turn. You did? Good. 
When it's your turn to have a second turn, Simeon, you can have a second turn. Let's have some of our other friends have their first turn, okay? Thank you. That's very nice of you to share. Ah, that was close. That was close. It just hit my elbow. Here, well, let's give Deb a turn. Why don't you move forward so you can have a turn? Go ahead, Deb. Whoa! Almost. You just didn't need to throw it so far. Let's give Sabrina a turn. You want the red one, Sabrina? Fine. You can use the red one. Almost. That was close. That was close. Let's let our other friend have a turn. Go ahead to the back of the line. You can get another turn later. There you go. Actually, I don't think we're going to have time for other turns. That was good. That was good. Come on. Aaron, you've already had a turn, haven't you? Yeah. Yeah, all right. Well, let's let our other friends who haven't had a turn have a turn. There are two friends who haven't had a turn. Okay. You, you had a turn, didn't you? No, okay. Good. Very good. Oh, that was close. Caught it in my hand. Go ahead. Let your, let's let our other friend have a turn. There you go. Oh, that was close. That was close. Jared, have you had a turn? Okay, Jared, you come here and have a turn. You had a turn, didn't you, Aaron? Yeah. Did you have a turn already, Jared? Oh, you did. So everybody's had a turn? Super. What we'll do then is since everybody's had a turn, we'll go away, and when we come back to Romper Room, we're going to have more fun. Give me a hug. Romper Room friends will return after these messages. Morning, kids. It's a Pac-Man day with my crispy corn cereal coming your I'm Blinky. I'm Pinky. I'm Clyde. We're the marshmallows. You'll find inside of Pac-Man. There goes a cat pop oh. and Easy too. Mm -hmm. He's Marshmallow. You can chomp him too. In Pac-Man. Part of this nutritious breakfast. It's Pac-Man. With marshmallows. Delicious. My little pony, pretty parlor. I pretty up my little pony there. My little pony, pretty parlor. Lovely hats for my pony. Decay and gum disease are caused by plaque, an invisible film of bacteria that sticks to teeth. Your dentist will show you a new way to make plaque easy to see. So you can use dental floss between the teeth and a soft bristle brush to clean the teeth every day. Now the plaque is gone and your teeth and gums will stay healthier much longer. This message has been brought to you by your local dental society. We now return to our balloon friends. Look what I have, friends. I have a balloon, and we have our two posts here with the string in the middle, and we're going to play volleyball. Now, volleyball's a team sport, so I have to put all of you in your place. Aaron, you stay there. You stay there, Deb. Jill, you stand right there, and you stay there, Jared. Sabrina, this is your space. Simeon, this is your space. When the balloon comes towards you, that's when you hit it. If it comes towards Aaron, Jared, don't you run over and try and hit it. You let Aaron hit it, okay? And Jill, same way. Jill and Deb, whoever it comes to, you hit it with your own place. You're ready? And at your house, why don't you pretend that you have a balloon, like we have, and you could see if you can hit it, or if you have a balloon, you can hit it back and forth to yourself in between your hands and play. You ready? Here we go. There you go, Deb. Hit it. One thing we have, I guess I didn't explain this, that's my fault. What you have to do in volleyball, when it comes towards you, don't catch it. When it comes towards you, you hit it back over the net. That's it, hit it, Simeon. There you go, hit it again. That's it, hit it, Aaron, good. Aaron, that was terrific, you hit it right over the net. That's it. There you go, Sabrina. That, you got a point, you sure did. There, Aaron, now go get it. Oh, Sabrina. Sabrina, grab the balloon and bring it back towards me, please. What you have to do, what you have to do is you have to stay in or glued to the floor there in this whole area. You can only go this far away from you, all right? And you stay in your spot, too. Now, Jarrett, you haven't had a turn. There you go. Hit it back. That's it. Jill. Good. Sabrina. That's it.
That's it. Hit it again. Oh, it hit the ground. It means we have to start again. You ready? Here you go, Aaron. Hit it. That's good. That was a spike. That was a silly spike. Here you go, Sibian. You ready? Oh, good. That's it. Hit it again. Sabrina, be careful. Stay in your spot. I don't want you to get hit in the face by accident, okay? That's why you have to stay in your own spot. Promise me? Good for you. Thank you. Here you go, Deb. That's it. Hit it again. Hit it, Jill. That's good. That's good. Go ahead. Get it, Sabrina. Hit it. That's it. There you go, Simeon. Ooh, hit it again. That's it. There you go, Sabrina. Back over into your spot. Oh, no. Hit it over the net. <laughs> hit it over the net. Hit it again. Over the net. That's it. Yeah, good, Jarrett. Uh oh. Sabrina, whose team are you on? Whose team are you on? You're on my team. Stay here. Wait. Hey, please don't. Please don't pull and please don't grab. You will both get a turn. What do we talk about all the time in Romper Room? Sharing. Sharing. It's very important to share. You know that. You're a good sharer. I know you are. There you go. Don't catch it, hit it. That'll wash off, Jarrett. That will wash off, I promise. Jill, it hit your head. All right, let's get ready. Move back. Move back a little. We want this team to be ready. Is our team ready? Yeah. Our team's ready. Here we go. That's it. Hit it again, Jarrett. That's it. Good. Hit it, Sabrina. That's it. Over the net. There you go. Over the net again. Oh, it hit the ground. It hit the ground. Well, let me have the balloon, please. <laughs> You know, as a matter of fact, I wouldn't doubt that. You all hit it over the, the net very well. But you know what we're going to do? We're going to quit playing volleyball right now, and when we come back to Romper Room, we're going to have more fun with our visitors. Romper Room friends will return after these messages. Presenting Ronald McDonald in Wild About Cheeseburgers. McDonald's cheeseburgers in the great outdoors. Hamburger's gonna try to grab our cheeseburgers by scaring us in a bear suit. They will act scared and pretend he's a real bear. Here he comes. Oh, a wild bear. Don't eat us, Mr. Bear. We've got some nice, tasty McDonald's cheeseburgers. And crispy golden french fries, you know. Cool chocolate shake. On second thought, we shouldn't feed the bear. <laughs> nice try, Hamburger. Come on out and have a McDonald's cheeseburger. We know you're in there. Grubble. Oh, hi, Hamburger. <laughs> hi, Hamburger. <laughs> oh, I'm getting out of here. <laughs> McDonald's cheeseburgers at McDonald's. I say we barely made it back. Barely? <laughs> at home, do you know how to play the yes-no no game? Yeah. Sure you do. Sure you do. I'm going to ask you some questions, and if the answer is yes, what do you do? Clap your hands. Yeah, clap your hands. Very good. If the answer is no, what do you do? Jump up and down. Jump up and down. Now, if all of you in the front here would move back a little bit, the friends at home will be able to... That's good. Stop. All right, now... This week in Romper Room, we've been talking about ecology and our environment and energy. And one of the most important things you should do around your house is save energy. And one of the ways you can save energy is you open the refrigerator, you close the refrigerator when you're finished eating. Yes or no? Yes. Yes. Do you walk away and leave the refrigerator door open? No. no. When you go outside with the grown-ups at your house, you just leave the front door open so the no. old, the air can get in no. and cool. You close. close the door. Yes, Simeon. Hmm? You have to play the game. You have to clap your hands and jump up and down, okay? 
If the answer is yes, you clap your hands. If it's no, you jump up and down. Let me, let me think of another question for you, Aaron, okay? Hang on a second, all right? When, let's see, Doobie told us that when you leave a room, you should turn the light off. But actually, you don't have to do that. You can leave and leave all the lights on in the house. Jump up and down. Give a little light and a big light. Come on over here, Jarrett, and play with us. I got a big light. One of the ways that you can help Joelle, come on and play with us, please. One of the ways that you can help the environment in your neighborhood through ecology is if you see any litter on the ground, you should pick it up and put it in the wastebasket. And we should never drop any litter on the ground ourselves, should we? Yeah. We should always put the waste in the wastebasket or in the garbage can. Yes, yes. One of the games that we like to play in Romper Room is the string game. And I have a string, and I'm going to play with it with you. You ready? Come on over here, everybody. Come on and join us. That's it. Can you? Come on, Beaver. Well, um, I want to be first. All right, Simeon, you can be first. You stand behind me, and everybody line up behind Simeon, OK? You ready? Everybody line up behind Simeon. Well, Joel, you'll get a turn, I promise. Would you like to help me by holding the string? Okay, you hold the string. Everybody, hold on to it. Everybody else, get in line, please. Get in line. That's it. Get in line. See if you can. Joel, you can go after Simeon. That's it. Go ahead, Simeon. See if you can jump out. No, all... wait, wait, wait. Please, I don't want anyone to fall. All you have to do is hold it still for me, okay? Jump over the line for me, Simeon. That's it. Go ahead, Joel. Go ahead, jump over it. Go ahead. Oh, almost. Here, grab it again for him. That's it. Hold on to it. That's it. Go ahead, Deb. A little higher, okay. There you go. Now go to the end of the line so you can have another turn. Simeon, back to the end of the line, you'll get another turn. A little higher. Go ahead. There you go. How about it, Jarrett? Higher. No, don't try and jump over it. When it's that high, you have to crawl under it, buddy. There you go. How's that? Okay, now jump over it. That's it. Good. Okay, we'll do it a little higher. Very well, I don't want you to hurt yourself. Do you want to crawl under it? Yeah. Okay, we'll hold it high so they can crawl under it. What do you say, Sabrina? You want it low? Okay. A little higher. Joanne, would you, Joelle, would you go to the back of the line where you were and you'll get another turn? Aaron, go to the back of the line, please, so you can get your second turn and other friends can have their first turn. Simeon, go ahead, okay? Thanks. Go ahead, Sabrina. Not too high. Not too high. There you go. Good. A little higher? Yeah. Not too high. Not too high. Put it down. Let me do the higher or low. That's it. Go ahead. All right. You want to try? Dana. Dana. Good for you, Dana. What do you say, Jill? That's it. A little higher? A little higher? Why don't you try this at your house? See if you can pretend that you're jumping over the stream with us. Wait, before you do it, so you don't trip. If you don't have one, you can pretend. Sure. There you go. Okay. Well, you could pretend. Yeah. There you go. Keep it coming. That's it. Go ahead, Sabrina. Now we're on our second turn. He doesn't want to. He doesn't have to. Go ahead. How about if you try and crawl under it? Let's hold it up so you can crawl under. Go ahead. See if you can crawl under without... Okay. Simeon, be careful. I don't want someone to jump into you. Go, go get back in line and you'll get another turn. All right? Go ahead back in line. Go under? Okay. You go under. You want to go over or under? Under. Go ahead. One more time. Over. And what I'm going to tell the friends at home is when we come back to Rompa Room, I'm going to see you in my magic mirror. Rompa Room friends will return after these messages. Charmkins, Charmkins, they love hanging all around. The nicest thing about Charmkins is their jewelry. Little mom and school mornings, take them with you around town. Now you can take them with you in the Charmkins jewelry case. You've got brown eyed Susan, too. She's pretty. Charmkins, Charmkins, they love hanging around. Charmkins smell so 
Oh, nice. Charmkin's Charms Accessories and Jewelry Case, sold separately from Hasbro. Yahoo! Let's slash a lucky and get his lucky charm! Not now, me friends. I need to be alone. I think of a new marshmallow surprise to add to me lucky charms. There's already pink hearts, yellow moons, orange stars, green clovers, and blue diamonds. But what should the new one be? Oh, something's coming to me. What's the new marshmallow surprise? And what does a purple horse have to do with it? You can find out inside boxes of new lucky charms, part of this good nutritious breakfast. We now return to our balloon friends. Friends at home, I want to tell you that this afternoon I'm going to be at the Chuck E. Cheese Pizza Time Theater in Wayne, New Jersey on Route 23. I'm going to be doing two shows, one at 12.30 and one at 2. That'd be great. Right. And I also want to tell you that today is a very special day in Romper Room. You've heard me talk a lot about Miss Elise, haven't you? Miss Elise takes our friends to the bathroom. Miss Elise. Miss Elise, have you? Come here. Come here, Miss Elise. Sit next to me and do the magic mirror with me, okay? Miss Elise is leaving Romper Room today. And I think that we should all thank Miss Elise for being so good to us all these years in Romper Room and taking care of our friends. And wish her good luck in her new job. Oh, thanks. You want to help me with the magic mirror? Yeah, <laughs> I think I know it. <laughs> you know it? Romper, bomper, stomper, boo. Tell me, tell me, tell me do. Magic mirror, tell me today. Did all my friends have fun at play? All my friends had fun today. I see Matthew and Ellie, and Elise is having a special day today. It's her birthday, too. And Andrew's having a special day, and so is Britt and Megan and Erica and Elena and Bobby and Fallon are having special days. And Eric and Ethel and Chad and Eon and Michelle had special days on Saturday. And Heather and Elizabeth and Patrick and Stacy and Sean and Jim Jim and Carissa had special days on Sunday. And I see Delane and Beckett and Katie, Laura and Anver and Britt and Nikki. Did you see anybody? I see Scott and Gert and Rachel and Merle and Bruce. Bye-bye, <laughs> friends. Have a good day. <laughs> Romper Room and Friends featuring Molly McCloskey is directed by John Wolfe. Production assistant, Elise Fisher. Switcher, Gary Rothman. Lighting director, Jerry Green. Audio, John Hogan. Stage managers, Linda J. Shears and Joe Wilmore. Cameras, Tina Ray, Howard Cohn, Lisa Rosini, and Bob Goodman. Video, Andy Polizano. Videotape, James Hollenbach. Intern, Laura Kuntz. Portions of the preceding program were pre-recorded. <laughs>